So now let's take a look at the third type of roles and that's Azure AD roles. And so Azure AD roles are used to manage Azure AD resources uh, in the directory, such as creating or editing users, assigning administrative roles to others, resetting user passwords, managing user licenses, and managing domains. And so on the right hand side uh, here, uh, what we can do is go into Azure Active Directory in Azure and under roles and administrators, we can see there is a bunch of roles predefined for us like application administrator, application developer, et cetera. There's a lot in there. And a, a few important built-in roles that you should know is the global administrator. So this gives you full access to everything. The user administrator, full access to create and manage users. The billing administrator makes purchases, uh, manage subscriptions and support tickets. And I want you to know that you can create your own custom roles, but uh, for whatever reason, you have to uh, purchase this. This to me is a bit unusual because in the AWS world, uh, this is something you don't have to pay for, but I guess Azure Active Directory has been around for a long time. And so they have a, uh, this whole big tier in there. And so if you want to be able to make custom roles, you have to upgrade your Azure AD to premium. So premium could be P1 or P2. And I'm assuming the higher the number, the more uh, controls, okay?